Hey up, McGoggin lives again. Now, I I was really hoping I'd have a Kerbal Space Program video to show you, but... <laughs> so, uh, I've been struggling for the past month with all these mods to try and create this new save file, and it's not been working, and it's been doing my bloody head in. So, uh, I'm, I've returned to Oedipus Island because, oh, why? Why would I ever want to leave? Just look at this ridiculous family. They've all aged up, look, Gideon and Gretchen. Oh, who's up? They must have heard me. Of course, we've got a uh, Janet here, withered, greying. Oh, oh, here's the, here's uh, here's uh, Gideon here. Oh God, just look at him. The hair of Bill Oddy in the face of Janet Street Porter. I mean, I haven't been actually to the Street Porter household in ages, and nothing's changed at all. There's just igloos everywhere. Oh, this is getting on my pissing nerves now. This bloody winter has been has lasted for so long. I mean, look at my farm. What am I supposed to do? I'll tell you what I need to do, actually. I need to dig it all up, build a greenhouse, get this all industrialised. Where are you going in, Igloo? What are you going in there for? Week three, day six. <laughs> it's only been three weeks. Well, four weeks. I mean, if you estimate it. And we've already got a small sort of... <laughs> A small population derived from two creatures. This is like what came first, the chicken or the egg. Only it's two lesser known British TV personalities. Oh, look at look at look at this thing and all. Fucking fat little shit. What's wrong with waffles? Nothing wrong with them. Get them eaten. Look at her, she's like chubby and all. Oh, scoffing ice cream at six in the morning. Anyway, uh, I'm not gonna fuck about with children anymore. That's why I'm on that register after all. Let's, let's get them let's get them growing up, working in the fields. Right, that's fine. That's fine. I wonder what this bitch looks like. Oh my god! Ugh. That is the most repulsive fucking thing I've ever seen. I think you know something, we're at the end of the year already. And uh, I suppose we've all been doing, oh what's your game of the year? This is my game of the year, the Sims 3. I know what you're thinking, hey, hey, it came out in 2009. Well, I've only started playing it this year, and... Oh, I mean, let's just look what we've done on it. <laughs> I don't really have any other choice in, in the matter. I mean, what, what, any, 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 any 2015 games that have been very good? Of course not, they've all been pissing disappointments, just like life. Oh, my... <laughs> These are two little gems, aren't they? I can't wait to see what their child's gonna look like. Fucking hell, the light. She looks like a redneck prom queen, and he takes after his father. You, you do look like somebody, though. Oh. Well, I was gonna, you know, give them new looks, but uh, fuck me. I am not doing a fucking thing to alter these bastards. Why are you so fat? Look at the tits. They're not, well, they're not existent. <laughs> Those dead eyes. She really does look like a fucking teen mom from Alabama. I mean, those are those flies orbiting the, the waffles, or are they orbiting her? Oh, they, I see. The she's she's she looks like Brannick. That, <laughs> I just <laughs> right. Let's not waste any fucking time. Let's not waste any fucking time. Oh. Oh, so I have to age him up again? Nah, no, bollocks, bollocks to that. There's got to be a way to make teenagers be able to do it. I mean, I'm not typing into Google how to make teenagers have sex, because fucking I'll have the police at my door. Yes, here we are. That's better. Well, it's not better. Oh my god, look, would you just read some of these? Teen adult woohoo? No, you know what, let's, 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 let's leave that. I'm not going to have any, any pedos here. I know Brannett's got a moustache, but come on, we have, we have standards on Oedipus Island. Ah, here we are. With Gretchen, yeah. Get on with it. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get fucking banned from YouTube. Fucking teenage pregnancy now. Fucking hell. I've turned into MTV. <laughs> Watch this, Dad. <laughs> oh, that's gross. Oh, look, and there's Brannett again, quaffing the alcohol. Fucking alcoholic, you really are. <laughs> It'd be great if you get. How do you get that machine where you can make alcohol? Well, I mean, uh, I mean, uh, nectar. As they call it. Get on with it! 
Why are you dressed like a Native American woman? I don't want you to clean up the mess. I want you to make a mess. What are you waiting for now? The rapture. Fucking, the, you can make pandas mate better than this. Shut up, you old crone. Oh, he needs a piss. Quick, strike while the iron is hot. Fucking here comes Brannick now. Just fuck off. Everyone's getting in the... I think I made this love shack a little too small. Go here, go. Don't complain, just do it. But there's nothing slowing you down. Brannick, stay the fuck out of the bedroom. That's their time. You really don't understand the severity of the situation, do you, Brannick? Your mother slash girlfriend is getting old. We need to keep the species going, and all you want to do is walk about. You don't give a shit, do you? All you care about is your fucking drink. Speaking of which, uh, a glass of rum here. Uh, Cockspur rum, it's called. Oh, for f it's bloody... This, this ownership, this bed ownership, that's what's doing it. What's the point of bed ownership? Right, you're, you... That, that side. No, that's, that's... Oh. Right, there's no more perfect time. You're doused in your own urine. This is ideal opportunity for life. I'm not going anywhere, sugar tits, until we get some, some bloody... Some fertilisation going on. Right, that's it. Right, there's got to be, there's got to be a better way. What about in the shower? Can you do it in the shower? No. What about igloo? Igloo! Oh, thank God. I would delete that bed and put a new one down. But that's the Genesis bed. That's th This is like the Holy of Holies. This is a relic that needs to be treasured for the generations to come. Because this is where our population was first derived. Oh, now, Perry, you're up there. Yes. Now, I want you to put your wrench in her toolbox. Shouldn't be difficult to get teenagers to get each other pregnant. Very fanciful, look at him. <laughs> no, you can have waffles when you've gotten yourself up the doff. There. Let's see how long it takes YouTube to <laughs> terminate my channel. Right. Enough of the bloody street porters. Been nothing but a pain in the arse, the street porters. I'm sick of them. Let's go and see how David Bowie's doing. With all this lovely money. <laughs> anyway, uh, Ted's parents are... <gasps> what? What? How did they escape? Oh, no. They, they, you in a public toilet? What, what's going on? I thought I defeated Ted. He's at school now. He's getting an education. Why? I put you in a hole. How did you get out? Evidently more drastic measures are going to have to be taken, aren't they? Oh, evidently you want to materialise. Materialise out of this cold earth, under a, a, several inches of snow. David Bowie's got all this lovely money. I don't know what he's doing. Can't, oh, he's meditating again. But he rock stars. Buy out the property. What does that mean? I've become a partner. Oh, I see. So you, you can become a partner and then you can buy it out. I suppose that's when you flat out own it. All right, well, we'll start with uh, the movie theatre and get it fucking eaten. Oh, oh, and look who it is. It's Bill and, uh, is that Sid? Where's, uh, where's the new bouncing baby brat? Ravioli. I suppose it must be in, inside, sheltering from the cold. Ah, uh, Bill, precious. Don't you think I've forgotten the great service you did our king? Hell, David, how long does it take to cinch a deal when you're David Bowie? I'm David Bowie. I'm buying out your property. That should be it. Yes! Full control. Oh, wow, you can rename it! And I can fire people! Wicked! Hmm. What should it... What should I rename it? I suppose I could call it Labyrinth. No. Man, I've bitten off more than I can chew here. I'm drawing a blank. Hang on. Have a, have a glass of rum. That usually helps the creative process. Hmm. No, no, it's still not... I know! I'm, I know what I'm going to name it. Well, I, not not yet I don't, but what the fuck am I doing? 
I mean, it's, the, the series is called Oedipus Island, and I didn't come up with that name. Uh, uh, tell you what, you people, you, you fellas, you, you can do it. Yeah, there we are. So if you're so inclined, please uh, leave a comment in, 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 the, uh, in the old comments section there with, the, with the, any ideas you have and what we could call this, uh, this fine establishment. Right, we've got to buy out this property then, because then I can rename it to get it fucking eaten. Oh, look, it's the family. <laughs> Just look how miserable she is. They really do look horrible as well. Honestly, I'm going to confess to you, I thought we were going to end up with an entire nation of Janet Street Porters and Bill Oddies. Like, sort of mix and match in terms of, uh, you know, what they look like. That maybe there'll be a kid with red hair and a kid with white... Uh, well, like a male, a boy with red hair and then a, a, a girl with white hair and then vice versa and all that. But, uh... No, they're getting uglier and uglier with every new generation that's born. It's fantastic. All right, get it renamed. I want my vision to come true. Get it fucking eaten. There it is. <laughs> oh, why? This is a lovely way to spend the Sims money. Oh, is that your car? Oh, no, that's the Sims car. You stole it, you bitch. Mind you, Ted stole my bloody car. Oh, I am sick of the Sims. The, um, the family. You. See ya. See? There it is. That son of a whore. He stole my car. I knew he stole my car. You can fuck off. You're not selling my bloody car. Little shit. Yeah. Yeah, this is excellent. I love all these horrible little people coming together to communicate with each other. You're going to visit your estranged family there, precious. Uh, there. Don't want to see any sandals on my island. Sandals, flip-flops, no. I'm not having it. <laughs> golden tongue and golden fingers. <laughs> it doesn't sound like you're talking about music to me, David. Wait a minute, what is that sound? Oh, they must be showing a... Oh, they're showing a movie. Oh, no, they've got a, a band playing. Cool. An intergalactic band that have approached... that have arrived at Oedipus Island. Fucking okay, bit of peace and quiet, please. Fucking, okay, we've got a band rattling away in town. I've got you playing music. Alan's birthday? No, I want you. I don't want you. You, witch, fat person. Wait a minute. Oh, fuck me. You're squeezing another one out, aren't you? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, my God. Oh, you look fairly normal. Ah, man of the house is back. Ah, <laughs> David Bowie's become quite attached to those kids. He's always had a way with children. Whisking them away to his castle and <laughs> dancing around with a load of goblins. This vile wretch has evaded my cheap commands to get her old. And she's wearing sandals. Goodbye, Bill. Thank God. Oh. Is this how it happens? Ah, there we go. <laughs> this is our first death on the island, isn't it? I'm just taking out the trash, really. Now get the fuck out, fucking Sims. Don't act all upset. Come on. I didn't invite you to this island. You came on your own accord. Jesus Christ, look how many cars this woman has. Look at them all. She's got about a thousand. She's got a small fleet of cars there. Oh, David, stop pretending to care. You can sell all these. Oh, good. At least I got my car back. Yeah, everyone, everyone's over the death. Very quickly. <gasps> David, stop flirting. You won't have much time. Jesus. It didn't take you, didn't take you long, did it? Look at that face. What the fuck? <laughs> What's wrong with you, David? Is that how you get over the death of somebody? By pulling your eyes into your brain? Oh, God. Oh, she's not dead. Fuck. I've had enough of you. Get out. 
So she's immune. She's immune to it because she's up the duff. I think I'm going to end this video with one final age transition. Beloved Ted. Dearest Ted. A glint in your eye. Macabre thoughts on the brain. Celebrating it by yourself. It's excellent really, isn't it? His father died about an hour ago, but he's he's, he's happy as out. Another fucking teenager. Oh, Ted, I, uh, well, uh, well, <laughs> that's, uh, I'm, I'm, <laughs> well, he's, uh, <laughs> oh, he's, uh, yeah, this, 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 maybe, 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 maybe we, there is a place on Oedipus Island for you after all, Ted, or maybe I won't have to kill you. Oh, <laughs> right, well, uh, I think that's a, a wonderful, a wonderful end to a, a, a semi, semi good video, subpar, really. Oh, well, <laughs> can't wait to get back to uh, documenting what Ted's going to do with his life. I mean, uh, what everyone's really going to do what, with their lives. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching. As always, uh, I'm McGog and Lives. <laughs> <laughs> can't remember any of the bloody controls. <laughs>